Leon Haslam was on pole position for the second Bennett's British Superbike race of the weekend at Donington Park. But it was a rocket start for Kyle Ride that put him into P1 at Turn 1. Jason O'Halloran also got off to a decent start on his McCams Yamaha, but into Redgate Corner, Leon Hasler managed to push his way through with Tommy Bridewell in hot pursuit of the leading group. Danny Kent at this stage was in fifth place, but there was drama for Glenn Irwin, who unfortunately uh, went out in the first sector. Bridewell then made his move on Leon Haslam to move up a spot, and Kyle Ride, whilst leading, made a rare error, leaving Tommy Bridewell to inherit the lead. The safety car came out, though, because of debris on the circuit, and then what a race. The final five laps were Haslam was leading, but O'Halloran came through. Haslam then bit back again. Everyone at this stage in with a shout of potentially winning the race. Tommy Bridewell then launched an attack into turn one. In the background, Josh Brooks was now fighting for a podium as well. Lee Jackson was also in the hunt for a podium. And Ryan Vickers, number seven on the OMG Yamaha, was looking for his first ever podium in Bennett's British Superbike. As the laps ticked down, they were three and four abreast heading into the Foggy S's. At this stage, Haslam and O'Halloran side by side, clipping the curb. We're going into the green, lifting his arm up and having to let Tommy Bridewell back through. But then watch this move from number seven, Ryan Vickers, as he went from fifth up into second in one corner. As we got to the closing stages, Josh Brooks made his move on Haslam to move up into third place. And as the chequered flag came out, Jason O'Halloran got back to winning ways. He was victorious ahead of Ryan Vickers, who picked up his first podium with Brooks finishing third and taking the championship lead.